Did you guys see him last night? Yeah, dude, you should have been with us. We took a whole six pack and Dylan's dad. It was my idea. No, wait, did, did you guys like get drunk and stuff? I don't remember a thing. I'd like to write out. You only had a sip, you loser. Oh, dude, this is not scared. <laughs> don't call me that. <laughs> It's really like a 12 pack of something. It had to be the lookout. You can't drink when I'm on the job. Like your dad's gonna wake up? Uh. Bell rang, boys. Whatever, Mr. Howard. It's just all a joke to you guys, huh? Let's see how funny these test scores are. Back in your seat. Dylan? You, you okay? Dylan. You okay, Dylan? Dylan, buddy. Dylan, wake up. Hey, Dylan. Oh my god, Rebecca! Rebecca, wake up! Rebecca, honey! Dylan, my man, you gotta get yourself some new porn. Want a beer? I'm on the clock. Where you been? Out. Crazy boy. You clean the spark plugs of that phone by with your goddamn tongue, and you can't sweep up in here every once in a while. And the only one comes around is you. Then you should make an effort. Where you been? Car wash. Hmm? Got an extra shift. Bullshit. Call. Think I won't? Think you should. Have you been associated with any known criminals? No, sir. Have not. Have you crossed over the state line at any time? No, sir, I have not. How's the job going? It's boring, but it's still mine. Two months. Ooh, gotta be some kind of record. Anything else you need to know? I need to know when you're gonna slip up and stick your peck in the grits again. This may be a dumb question, but what did I ever do to you? You went into other people's houses and took things that didn't belong to you, things that they worked long and hard for. And I paid my debt, kittens. My conscience is shiny and new. Yeah, well, how about Bo and Lyle? Bo and Lyle weren't on that job. <laughs> so the record states. Hey, that's real sweet of you to take the hit for your old school buddies. Kittens, all due respect, you're not a detective. You're my P.O. And I know that you ride me more than most. Why? You're smart. And ain't nothing in this world dumber than a smart guy. A smart man, he sees beyond his little world and it kind of warps him. So when he makes that wrong move, and you will, it tends to be messy. Well, maybe there's a side of me you don't see. As long as you're on parole, you are only what I see. Now, I'd like the doors if I was you. There's burglars and thieves around these parts. I wasn't gonna make it. Yeah, I wasn't sure that I was. But that's right, you've only had 12 hours to change. 
You should have started last night. Ha ha, she said game wing. <laughs> well, two of our trustees are going to be at the Thomasons. Do I have to be charming? No, just be yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, you need to be a little charming. Just nod and smile and talk to the wives. It's the Thomasons. Dorothy will be there. You can gossip behind our backs. I promise to turn my back as often as possible. Is that what you're wearing? <laughs> Nothing. I'll spot you three balls this time. All tapped out, buddy. Come on, man. Don't be a pussy. You got some green right there in that pocket. No, I'm good. Hey, you walk out on a man, he's still gambling. You might catch a bad hey, boy. He's starting fights again, Dale. <laughs> Why don't you rack them up, big guy? I'll be happy to take those cash off you. Come on, man. Let me buy you a beer. So what you been working on, man? Dirty cars, mostly. Yeah? That sounds shitty. Better work's coming. You know, a lot of businesses going belly up in this economy. You ready? Tons of shit just sitting there. Just waiting to be picked. I know you could use the money. Especially if you ever want to play pool again. <laughs> this is a big flush. Well, hell, let's change that. Hey, can I get a beer here from my poor relation? What are you seeing? No getting finds out that you and Bowie have been chatting. He's going to send you right back up. Yeah, they probably will anyway. <laughs> Personally, I think you're a shoe. I don't know, guys. The city council would be a good staff, but I still have a hospital one, you know? I'm just, I'm not sure I'm ready to move on. He thinks the Mandolf protests too much. <laughs> not at all. He's still got four months of protesting ahead of him. Wait until we start begging before you announce. Please don't ever start. <laughs> a rumor, sweetie. It's an undeniable truth. They might as well be written in print. What's the truth? Chief Booth is having a thing. He's taking lovers. Just <laughs> one, sweetie. Paula Dodd. Paula Dodd? Mm. Is she that? She's yeah, that she run that gift shop? Sells those ceramic things? Oh, yes, thank That's you. A, she's good. Oh, she's oh, God, she's absolutely but she has a right to kill her husband. She can't That's all I'm saying. Hey, Donna. Hey, Donna. Mm -hmm. Can you buy me a drink? Uh, yeah. Damn. I'm cleaned out right now. I mean, I would. You can have mine. Oh. That's okay. <laughs> I don't want your cuties. No, no, no. I've been to a specialist about that, and they turned out to be banana cuties. Wait, what? Nothing. It's just a... So, what's been going on with you? Oh, just, you know, the usual. Hey, you working? Yeah, yeah, I'm over at the, uh, National Car Wash, still. That's cool. Yeah. Okay. Uh, um... Well, I was, you. okay, yeah, let's just talk later. Yeah, Okay. I'll see you around. All right. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the best thing in the world, really. I mean, I only took the class because Dorothy was taking it. And, and for the naked men. And for the naked men, of course, but now it's really an obsession. The drawing, I mean. <laughs> <laughs> what about you, Becky? Do you ever think about taking classes? Oh, I... <laughs> to take a painting class for a while, but I'm really no good. Well, you're not out to make a living, sweetie. Drawing would be good for you. It clears out the cobwebs. I mean, not that you have got any cobwebs. I had a streak, boy! You won't believe me when I was on a streak! I had a streak! Come on, boy! Hey, you boys keep me light now! Come on! Come on! Come You all right? Man, I didn't even see him coming. Well, he knocked the living chest out of you, man. You okay? Yeah, fine. Well, let me pull you a beer on the house. How about it? <laughs> okay. I'll pass, Wayne. Thanks. <laughs> Rebecca! Is she okay? I'm sorry. Sorry, I'm fine. Oh my god. Yeah. Major point, guys. You're welcome. <laughs> Give me a little warning next time you get another seizure, okay? I mean, honey, it really was quite a show. It was a muscle spasm. I guess. It hurt a lot. For a second, I felt like somebody hit me. The look on your face, Becky. 
It's a little much, you know? Even for someone with a muscle spasm. I guess for a second I was worried this was the beginning of another. It's not. It's not. Okay. Your shoulder rub will get home. It doesn't hurt anymore. What time is it? Oh, shit. When we were younger, we, everyone was on our side. Shit. Then we grew a little and romanticized the time. I saw flowers in your hair. It takes a boy to live. It takes a man to pretend he was there. Be in my eyes. Be in my heart. Be in my eyes. So now that I walk you back, and I don't think I can take it, you're so attractive from the way you move. I won't close my eyes. Be in my eyes. Be in my heart. Hello. Hi. Anything in particular? No, I'm just stocking up. What's going on? Stop it! Stop this! Stop hey, it. shut up! Can you hear me? Who are you? I'm sorry. I'm sorry? What am I sorry about? What'd I do? Who are you? I asked you that. I'm looking at a store window. Am I looking at a store window? Yes, I am. Are you me? No. No, no, no. You're in my head. You're in my head. I'm having... I'm losing... Where am I? What? Where am I? Uh, you're on the road. You're on a road. There's a truck. I don't understand. What does the truck mean? Well, that means I have a truck. It's my truck. I have a truck. You have a truck? 
Yeah. Why, what do you have? What? Oh, I'm a Range Rover. Nice, safe. <laughs> I can see out there. I can see here, too. It's like one's close and one's far away. I just focus and I can see what's here. Or what's in my head. This ain't your head, lady. This is New Mexico. Wait, you're real. You're a real person. Oh, that's the sweetest thing anybody said to me all day. I don't understand this. It's cold. Wait, are you, are you cold there? Yeah, it's, um, it's almost winter. I can feel it. Oh, this is too crazy. And I can hear you like... I can hear myself. Where are you? If you're not in my head, then where are you? Exeter, New Hampshire. New Hampshire? <laughs> Get out of here. Wait a minute, what time is it? You know, what, what day? Um, it's Thursday, the um, 24th. Okay, well that's the day, I think. Do you have a watch? Yeah. Oh my God. You're in the future. You're two hours in the future. No, I'm in a different time zone. Oh, yeah, right. Can you hear my thoughts? I don't know. Uh, think something. Okay. What should I think about? I'm not allowed to tell you. Right. Okay. You know, I, I got nothing. I'm thinking about new sneakers. Okay. Weird one. Uh, all right, well, hey, what if we just vote for Becker? You all right? Hello? You there? Hi. Chief Booth. Are you okay? Yes. I'm fine. I'm so sorry. I think I fell. I think I'm... Did you hurt yourself? No, I think maybe I had bad clams or something. Um, are you... How are you? How's Audrey? She's good. She's great. Are you sure you're all right? Yeah, I'm, I'm great. I'm great. Maybe if you just, um, walk me to my car to be sure. Absolutely. You know. Where are you? I think I'm parked right over here. You sure? Okay. I'm totally fine. Are you there? Wow, uh, guess we got disconnected. Yeah, someone came, I had to cut you off. So, wait, how? I mean, I could feel you trying to come in. It was um, this kind of swimmy feeling in the back of my head, but I could stop it. That's good to know. Yeah. Uh, I can't talk here. People are um, staring at me. Right, and yeah, and assuming I still got a job, I need to get to it, but uh, I mean, we gotta talk about all this. Okay, later though, um, seven o'clock? Okay, well wait, that's uh, that's five my time, I'm still at work. Say 10, eight, eight for me? Yeah, great, fine, okay. Okay, uh, and if, you know, it doesn't work for some reason, then uh... It was nice meeting you. Hey, it's snowing. Oh my God, it's almost done. Why, yes it is. Is it, is it some cause for excitement? No, 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 no. It's just we ate so late. Yeah, I told you it was gonna be a long day. Yeah, I know. No, I was just, I just meant, I just meant you must be tired and thinking about going to bed. Well, I'm not. Is that okay? Of course. Good. Actually, um, there was a show I wanted to, uh, to watch. Oh, yeah, that sounds fun for you. Oh, my God. Well, yeah, hi. 
Oh boy, did I not expect this to work? I thought I was just. I know, I did too. Oh man, okay. Well, uh, I just I spent all day just trying to think why this could be happening. So, did you come up with anything? Well, you know, one thing did occur to me. Are you, by any chance, Satan? No, um, my name is Rebecca. That's well, I didn't even think of that. I'm Dylan. Dylan. That's nice. This is a nice room. Uh, is this your place? Uh, yeah, this is my house. I mean, it's my husband's. You're, oh, you're married. Yeah, why not? I mean, you got a name, you could be married too. Did you tell him about it? Um, no, I, uh, I, I just wasn't sure. Um, yeah, I mean, uh, maybe it's better if you don't right away. I don't know, this is just hard enough to believe if it's happening to you. Yeah. I'm gonna wait. Wait. So, this is your house? No, it's, yeah, yeah, it is. But uh, it's a little messy. <laughs> it's kind of the maid's decade off. Ugh. Wait, what are you doing? I, it's better this way. You shouldn't have to. <clears throat> I don't really have girls over too much. Oh my god, I have to ask you. Did you, um,. Did you get hit last night on the shoulder, like, like really hard? Yeah, sure did. Yeah, some bitch just like came at me with, with a pool cue. I know I was there, and I was also at this dinner party. <laughs> Trying to fend him off. Becky. Hi. Sorry, it's Becky Madden. I was just telling her about my smooth move last night. Oh. You must tell it really well. Yeah, what was that? Oh, God, yes, the kids sound amazing. I can't believe that. That was very smooth. Thank you, Vicky. So that was your husband? Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, that's Philip. Good looking guy? Yeah, doctor. He oh. runs the um, hospital here. Oh, professional man. <laughs> yeah. I should probably go. Oh, well, uh, do you want to talk again tomorrow? Okay, but after Philip goes to work. You're not, like, planning on getting hit again, are you? Well, let's see. It's not in my book. <laughs> yeah, that wouldn't have been anyway. Worst I ever took was... Oh, my God. What? Let me ask you something. Did you ever go sledding? Did you ever go sledding and get really hurt? I hit a tree. Jesus, H. God! I got knocked out cold. I mean, I, I must have been out for more than a minute. I still have the scar. Dylan, that was 20 years ago. I'll be damned. Dishes, and my mom never let me go sledding again. Not that I was all that keen to. <laughs> hey, what about when you were like, I don't know, maybe 16? Or you were all torn up about something. I want to say it was like the dead of summer, and I mean, it must have been a killer because I must oh, have been crossed out for a month. That is so embarrassing. <laughs> what? I can't tell you. It's um, too personal. Oh, come on. You got to. You owe me a whole July. That was. Walter, my first boyfriend. I was so in love with him. He was 20, you know? I don't know, we went out for like two months and then he broke up with me right after we, you know. Oh, oh. no wonder. <laughs> yeah, I mean like right after. <laughs> what a dick. Sorry if I uh, ruined your summer. <sighs> no, it's cool. I was you know, pretty used to having like weird moods and you know stuff I couldn't really explain. Yeah, me too. I pretty much thought that you were PMS. Yeah, a lot of people get us mixed up. <laughs> I remember some other stuff too, but I don't know. I guess it's all kind of personal. Like your mom. Yeah, that figures. You were in college, right? Yeah. She wasn't ever very well. She was like me, kind of. Um, 
not much of a physical specimen. Still, there's something it didn't make any sense to me at the time, but you know, I always felt like there was someone with me. You know, just like a feeling. I felt it um, more strongly than ever after she died. It helped. Did you ever feel that way? Why don't you tell me? I remember your first night in prison. Oh, yeah. Right, time to come clean. What did you do? I, uh, just... Good with locks. Not that good with silent alarms. Got two years. In with mostly lifers. Yeah, I figured that was nightmares. It was really terrifying. Yeah. Yeah, I never felt as alone as I did in there doing my bid. You weren't. Hey. <laughs> Jesus, hey. What? Go look in the mirror. What? Come on. I don't even hardly know what you look like except mostly your hands. Um, um. Go on, show me. I, you know, why don't you do that? Cuz, I asked first. Well, I'm not doing it unless you do it too. <sighs> okay, but after you. I'm not even dressed. Well, come on, whose fault is that? Lazy bones? Let's go. Fine. This is ridiculous, I'm scared. Oh, come on, what do you got to be scared of? Shut up, you're scared too. Okay. I'm going to the mirror now. God, how beautiful. Oh, don't be stupid. Yeah, no, when I said beautiful, like I meant, you know, Ugly, work covered, right? What did I say? Just don't flatter me because I spent the night in prison with you. What are you talking about? Hey, look, I was having fun being a beautiful girl there. I was all ready to go buy hats or something. Go back. No, no, it's your turn. Hold on, just give me a second. It's your turn. Read him and wait. You got such a nice face. Nice, huh? Oh, no. I mean, yeah, it is. Well, it ain't much, but it does cover my unsightly skull, so that's a plus. Hi. Hi. No, no. No, it was nothing like that. We, um... We actually met when he, when he lectured at my school. I know, it sounds terrible, but it was really nice. We just got along great. And what did you say? Oh, nothing. Um, I was the phone. Uh, did you figure it out? I, I wish I could describe it better. It was like a, a chugging noise. Yeah, like I know. What it is, you got a crack in your manifold? They go on you. Need to replace it. Okay. Uh, let me check my stock and uh, probably rack you up today, yeah? Yeah, that's great. Excellent. Thank you. What year's your truck? Oh, uh, uh, 2010. There's no way the exhaust system on a Range Rover would go after just a few years. Here, turn her over. Okay. Now go look under the hood. Like, what now? No, after he charges you 1200 bucks. Yeah, come on. Okay. What am I looking at? Okay. That sounds like it could just be the sensor got loose, so that should be over by the ABS. I don't know what that is. Oh, uh, that, that, that boxy thing there. Okay, over here? Mm, no. Okay, try the other side. Over here? Uh, it's like a multi-prong thing. You're looking for like a multi-prong plug-in thing. See that? Yeah. Yeah, that's it. What do we do with it? Yeah, look, it's loose. Plug it in. <laughs> that's your problem right there. <laughs> the sound stopped. Yep. That's it? That's it. I fixed it. Yes, it did, darling. Hey, we're in luck. I could take you today. We are in luck. The intake and exhaust manifolds are both fine. The, um, uh... Sensor. Sensor just needed tightening. <laughs> I don't think that's going to do you much good in the long run, but, yeah, I can take care of it for you. No, that's all right. I already did it. Thanks, Dan. And they put me in prison. I've been looking for...
cleansing business treating you. Actually, I've been thinking about looking for some new work. Who with, Bo, Lyle? I want to see if I can't scare up something better. I mean, I ain't gonna quit or nothing. Not until I'm sure, but... What's with you? You got a funny look. What? You look like you're about to kiss me. Well, I mean, when the light hits you like that, something about your head. Well, solicitation is a crime, so what's going on, Christian? Nothing's going on. For such a smart man, you are a pissed po -lie. I met someone. <laughs> well, it is. Yeah. You getting your pecker waxed, huh? She know you a con? She doesn't seem to mind. Oh, you got you one of them classy women. You'd be surprised. Nothing you do could surprise me. Over there. Like that you told him you had a girlfriend. Yeah, well, some people will believe anything. Come on, you've had girlfriends. Nothing that lasted more than a few days. It's not good with women. What about your man needs? Becky, I got a man like a sewer. <laughs> Shoot. Just move the other six back, and then you can move that one over. No, dummy, that's cheating. It's not cheating, it's creative. It's no fun to cheat. It's no fun if you win. The only reason you don't cheat is because you're afraid someone will get mad. Can't always do what you're told, darling. Spoken like a true convict. I'm sorry. What? No, no, it's, yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I got no right to be touchy. It's all true. Oh, hey, uh, I think I figured it out. You know, why it happened or why we opened it up when we did. Really? Really. Why? Why not? What up, Dill Pickle? Uh, I gotta go, Becky. Got something I gotta do. Okay, I'll see you. Grooming Tech Supply. The bitch is ripe, Dylan. Is it? You know our cousin Adam? The one who beat that aggravated assault charge against that 7-Eleven clerk? Kicked his lard asshole up and down the freezer section? He's been working maintenance in the office park. He says grooming is empty as church service on a Super Bowl Sunday. Here's the best part. No sign of alarms. Don't it just make your heart sing? I don't know. I mean, you know Giddens is just drooling for me to make a move like this. Well, don't worry about Giddens. He'll sleep through it. Your end is two hours at most. You open up the pearly gates, we handle the rest. You don't want to be seen with us. Yeah, I get it. I get it, man. Hell, we'll mail you your cut. I could use some walking around money. Yeah, but this is more than just walking around money. We got a fence lined up in Wilberfield. It's going to buy the whole lot. If your parole gets through, this is you setting up in a new town. Like a proper man. All you got to do is keep a pretty trap shut, Dill Pickle. Who's ever going to know? I don't know, I just ain't exactly good timing for me. What else are you gonna do, man? You just gonna wax a bunch of caddies? Dylan, this was your idea. When you got out, you asked for some action. Something to get back on your feet, something safe. Now, this is way the hell out in Bedlow, and all that equipment just sitting there. There ain't nobody, it's gonna rust. There's no victim here. Yeah, just a true convict. Dylan, we let you in on this because you asked. Now, I don't like you knowing if you don't have a stake in it. We'll be waiting on you, boy. Catch you soon, Dill Pickle.
Hey. Oh, sorry you startled me. Sorry. You know how I get in these places. Yeah, I do, which is why I'm surprised to see you here. Everything all right? Yeah, everything's fine. I was around and I had a wild notion you might be free for lunch. Uh, uh pretty wild notion. Look, I still got my doctor's cap on, I'm afraid. Um, Maynard's here to discuss his research program. Oh, the, um, the schizophrenic narco Narcotherapy. It's a big word, huh? Oh, which reminds me, next Thursday's the big fundraiser, so don't put us down for anything. Okay. Okay, good. Dennis. Hello. You remember my wife, Becky? Oh, yes. Nice to see you Dr. again. Dr. Maynard. Do you two have plans? Oh, no. Um, I just need to remember to call ahead first if I'm going to be spontaneous. <laughs> I see. Okay, I'll just leave you guys then. Okay, I, I shouldn't be late for dinner. Okay, and um, I'll see you Thursday at the fundraiser. I look forward to it. Mm, it's hard to tell right off. Yeah, I wish you could have spent more time with her. I, I didn't know she was coming. Well, I, I see what you're talking about. Her, her body language is very protective, very concealing. Mm -hmm. She's deeply uncomfortable. It's odd. Yeah, she's always been skittish. I, I just, I don't know. Wait, wait, who's this guy? That's Muffin Mike. He's muffled been busted for about eight years, so everyone knows when he's done. And that is Bob Greasy. We call him. Yep, Greasy Bob. Okay, so it's not brilliant, but. It's... Yeah, <clears throat> I uh, well, actually worked with him once on a highway job. He's got a real interesting smell. <laughs> Got a problem, buddy? Tell him to go fuck himself. No. Go no. fuck yourself, nope, dude. No, no problem at all. We're cool. Such a rim. Do you like it when we get hit? Hey, who's that? She's hot. Yeah, that's Donna. She's a nice girl. She's a nice girl? Is she married? Is she covered in sores? Not to hear it. Wait, she's waving. I know. You guys are friends? Ask her out. I'm not gonna just ask no, her. No, don't be a wuss. You know you want her. Shut up. Look, she's coming over. What is this strange power you have over women? You don't shut up, I'm gonna shut you out. You better not, not when your girlfriend's here. Hey, Dylan. Come to you, wench. Hey, Donna. Hi. Are, are you uh, here alone? Oh, Jenny's supposed to be coming, but... Haven't seen you around much lately. Haven't been around. <sighs> Duh, see you like her shoes. Uh, not like your shoes. They, they're, they work. I can't believe you noticed them. I got them on sale. They pretty much go with everything, yeah. See, you compliment them on something they did or bought. Not like their eyes or something they were born with. That's how they know that you like them. You like their taste. You like their- Shut up. Hmm? Oh, I just hate this song. You're joking. This is like my favorite song. Oh, I know. I just, I've heard it just so many times. Oh, yeah, that's true. They do play it a lot. Ask her out. Ask her out. Ask her out. Say, Donna, I was thinking, uh, are you, are you busy Tuesday night? I'm busy most nights. What did you have in mind? Oh, I just thought that, uh... I could cook for you. I could cook for you. I could cook you dinner. You cook? Yeah, I mean, well, I think too. What do you like? Um, well, I like steaks. <laughs> Big steaks. All right, all right. Yeah, I could, uh, I'll fix you up. A rare steak with a fancy sauce and trimmings for days. <laughs> and good if you're not too busy. I am so smooth. Tuesday, I'm seeing my mama, but I think Thursday, I'm free. Dinner. Dinner 6 30. No, 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 no. I'm busy Thursday night. You're not coming. Jenny's here. So, 6.30. 6.30. OK, gotta go. 6.30. Philip and I have a fundraiser Thursday night, you dope. Yeah, what you think I want you to put on my date? Tell me how to kiss and stuff? Who made you ask her out? You couldn't even talk to her. You're nothing without me. Still not coming. I made you, and I can break you. <laughs> mm. Well, you know, I can't think of a better place to put your money than in the research fund. Oh, well, of course you can't. Your husband's on the board. <laughs> <laughs> but no, you're right. Sick people are always the best. We lump them throat stuff. These hospital charities give me cripples every time. Oh, well, these are psychos, not cripples. But, you know, um, would you mind excusing me just a minute? How's it going? What? How's it going? Oh, I'm fine. Yeah, bye. What do you want? No, 
chatting. I'm just checking in, seeing how it's going. Yeah, everything's great. Your sauce is burning. So nuts. I haven't cooked anything that didn't take microwave instructions since ever. Here, smell this. What is that, um, rosemary? Yeah, too much? No, no. It's a little thick, though. You said it's supposed to be thick. Yeah, but it's maybe not like thick as a brick. Oh, you hate this shirt. No, it's, oh, it's, this is the wrong shirt. Yeah. Women everywhere revile this shirt. Dylan, Dean, the tie's a little rodeo, but it's gonna be okay. Yeah, easy for you to say. How's your money dinner? Oh, you know, stuff shirts anonymous. I just have to worry about not falling asleep. Okay, you're gonna be great. Good luck. Nice. Hi. Hey there. Good. How are you? Welcome to go. Shit. Hold up. Okay. Everything. Oh, that's good. Yeah, that'll be great. Yeah. Come on in. Okay. Never seen your place before. Devin? I thought you went out here for the fourth? I don't think so. Oh, I thought you were. Mm. Yeah. I had a barbecue. It's kind of my own concept barbecue on the fourth of July. Lots of people do that. Uh, I, uh, oh, I really like your, your shoes. You got a thing for feet? Dated a guy like that once. Real weirdo. No, no, I don't. Uh, do, can, I, can I use something to drink? I did uh, pick up some red wine, if you like. Oh. You got a beer? Oh, yeah, yeah, definitely. I'll take one of those, actually. <laughs> yeah. Thanks. It's a twist, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. So, you really cook and everything? No, man. Yeah. <laughs> What's this? It's a sauce. <laughs> that smells kind of crazy. Ugh, bimbo. Well, it's not for tonight. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. I don't like my steaks all fancy. Just burn black with time to ketchup. Mm. <laughs> Who cares? Figures what? Sorry? <sighs> I thought you'd spoken. Oh, gosh. <laughs> Maybe I did. I think I was. <laughs> No. Hot, hot, hot! Oh! Oh! In the sink! Ah. In the sink! In the sink! In the sink! Ah. There. Happy now? Me? Maybe you better go wash that off, honey. Stay out of this field. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. Uh, yeah, why don't you go to the bathroom? Collect so yourself. Oh, uh, you're right, honey. Just it's okay. It's okay. You guys okay? Yeah. yeah. Did fine. you get anything on you? No, I'm fine. But is she all right? Yeah. She's fine. She's fine. Who's Phil? Just, just give me a second. Okay. What did you think you were doing? I told you not to come along anyway. I had everything under control. You had everything on fire. Yeah, well, that's the way I like it. Sure, burnt block, tons of ketchup. It's none of your business. What she eats, you eat. Yuppie snob, that's my date. Yeah, well, you know, you sure know how to pick them. What's the matter? Are you jealous? <laughs> no, I'm not jealous. Then butt out. Why don't you make me? Just make me. You think I won't? Yeah, sure, try. There. That's all you got? Huh? Stop it. Did it again. Did it again. Dylan, stop, stop it. I won't. No, I'm not going to. I won't. <laughs> hey, Donna. Hey. hey, I'm just uh, putting on some aftershave. <laughs> just freshen up a little. Let go. Donna. Dylan. Donna, wait. I was just making a joke. I was just putting on aftershave. You are gonna speak to me again before we die, right? What do you want me to say, Rebecca? Thank you. I'm so glad you made us look like idiots. You didn't even apologize to Dr. Maynard. I don't like Dr. Maynard. He always looks at me like he's trying to guess my weight. He was trying to raise money for an important project I happen to be involved with. Philip, I can't say what happened. I think maybe I dozed off for a second. 
I was confused. Haven't you ever done that? That's not it. I mean, that may be true, but something is happening to you. And I don't know if it's what happened before it's or not. not. Believe me. Okay, then what? What? I don't know, Philip. Sometimes, sometimes you just look at everything and it's all just different. Do you know? Yeah, I do. They call that puberty. No, it isn't just then. It never stops. It's like, um, like shedding your skin. Is that what you're doing? Shedding? Yeah, I guess sort of. Shedding me? I'm really sorry. I know I messed it up. I know. No, no, it's cool. I, I wouldn't mess it up myself anyway. You just saved me time. Give yourself a little credit. That girl really likes you. Well, if she did, I think she got over that pretty quick when she caught me talking to the little man inside my head. <sighs> yeah. Right. It's just sometimes when I'm with you, I forget myself. You feel funny. What? Don't you feel funny? Like, not... A fever, but oh, I um, I was uh previously engaged in a certain kind of activity, and um, nope, <laughs> oh, uh, well, you smell nice, kind of sweaty. Sorry, that uh, was out of line. I didn't, uh, I should go, okay, um. Look, I'm sorry about tonight. Yeah, me too. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. <laughs> okay, well, wait, here goes a good one. Number seven, how does your partner rate as a lover? Pass. No, wait. Pass, pass, pass. It's none of your business. Of course it's my business. Hush up. You describe your lovemaking as A, wild animals. B, sweet and slow. C, at least he tries. D, just another. Who's this over to? Oh, no. Uh, B, A. No, no. Yeah. B? Okay, if you say so. Nine, how often do you and your mate. No, pass. Why? Pass. Come on, this isn't going to work wait. unless. Turn up the radio. Oh, you like this? Yeah, I love this song. Oh, yeah, I remember this. I stand up so I can fall. I swarm out so I can wait for you to call. I just look at you, baby, that's all. I'm crumbling. I wake up and you're not there. I call my Crumbling. Hey. Hi. Is this more uh, shedding? No. This is dancing. Uh, yeah, it is. <laughs> okay. Um, I'll see you.
So what brings the party down here? I was just looking for my old photo albums. I thought they were in the corner. Uh, yeah. Yeah, uh, last time I saw them, they were... God, I hope we didn't throw them out. No, that doesn't make any sense. You hey, asked... I ran into Diane. She said you were gonna do the painting class. The drawing class. The drawing class, yeah. Yeah, I don't have to. What? No, I think that's great. You know, get you out of your... the... cellar. <laughs> Why would Bridget throw out my photos? No, no, I'm not saying just, you know, whatever, by accident. What do you want with them? Anyway? Nothing. I just wanted to show them to, 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 um, myself, look at them. I mean, I, I'm not saying don't find them. It's a healthy thing. That's good. And actually, I, I can help you look for them. I, I have my, uh, council meeting at six, but, um, you know, it won't kill me to be a few minutes late. Yes, it will. Thank you for knowing that about me. Hey, is my uh, gray shirt clean? Uh, yeah, I'll check. Thank you. Everything come out all right? <gasps> You're drunk. I ain't had hardly nothing to drink. But give me time, partner. I got wine on my damn pants. <laughs> What's Philip gonna think? Where is old Phil? Meeting? Have I given you the tour of my luxurious home? Yeah, you have. Elegant, modern entertainment center. The perfect addition to every home. Did you find those pictures you were gonna show me? Yeah. They're gone. Well, wait a minute, what happened? They're gone. I have been through the entire attractively furnished house. Maybe the maid ate them. Or maybe my husband slipped them into the trash. Are you serious? Why the hell would he do that? Because he knows me. Philip takes care of me. That's not, that's, that sucks. He's not being mean. He knows how funky I get sometimes looking through that stuff. It doesn't matter anyway. I know them all by heart. There's my mom when she's little. She has my eyes, blue gray with flecks of panic. And here's mom teaching me how to swim. <laughs> Notice how I'm grafted to her arm. Not a success. And there's a picture of a pony. <laughs> I don't know why it's in there, who it belonged to, but there it is anyway. And there's my dad. Scariest man who ever lived. Grown-ups were scared of him. <laughs> All they ever taught me was how to be afraid. I went out and found the coopingest man alive so he could take care of me. So he could get rid of the past. Chipping away at it. All my little quirks and insecurities. Until, voila, nothing left. Ha! <laughs> Nothing like a little truth to sober you up, huh? Tell you about my family. I got a brother uh, named Mitch. I think he was down in Louisville now. Moved 1,500 miles away so that he wouldn't have to loan me any more money. My mama, I, just, I put her through so much. By the time I got popped, she just stopped talking to me. She didn't even wait for the trial. I've never met anyone I didn't disappoint. I mean, the best thing, the only thing about me that I like is you.
want to know what you feel like. Cut it out, it's good. It's cool. Look at my ass. <laughs> a little abstract there, darling. Try drawing the nice man. <laughs> oh. Gotta go, darling. Okay, I'll see you. What's going on, Jake? It's no good. It's, what is? It's no good. It doesn't work. Wait, wait, am I fired? Okay, you're me, Dylan, okay? What would you do? Keep the ex-con who talks to himself all day? You frighten the customers. Look, next time you get a gig, okay? Just let your imaginary friend stay at home. Okay. You gotta start living in the world, brother. You, you gotta be where you at. You understand what I'm saying? Be where you at. Okay. I'll, I'll give you a recommendation if you need one. I won't lie. But I'll, I'll, I'll say you were honest. Tell me. You really should. Sweetie, I honestly, I have no idea what you're talking about. Not at all. Well, everybody's concerned. Is something going on? You can tell me. There's just really nothing to tell. Have you been seeing someone? Oh, God, no. No, 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 no. I, I couldn't. I'm married. I would never. Oh, I meant a shrink. You're having an affair. Oh, oh my God. No, 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 no. You don't no, have no, to no. tell me who no. unless you want to. Because Diane, I'm very honestly, good at keep... Diane, I'm not. I'm not having an affair. Oh, and I'm we not. never had this conversation. <sighs> oh, poor Philip. Oh, I didn't mean that. I'm you really... know what? You don't have to tell me who. That just explains everything. Explains what? <sighs> well, I don't mind telling you now that I know you're not crazy, but everybody's talking. Well, you must know that. Everybody's talking about me. Why? Don't they have lives? Oh, my lips are sealed. They are ziplocked. You don't have to tell me who he is, but is it someone I know? Diane, some... honestly, I'm not having an affair. No. I'm not, I swear. Okay? I'm just crazy. Amazing! That's possibly the greatest game of pool ever played. <laughs> Hi, Bill. Queen of the rodeo. Rodeo queen, huh? What, you came to watch me make pool history? <laughs> oh. Had a few pictures, haven't you? You know, my only regret is that I gave up my law practice to become a showgirl. Can I pour myself for one? Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, 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 have a, have a beer. I'm just gonna find this ball. So, Wayne says that Jake gave you the can. Oh. 
That blows. Hey, don't it, sister? Oh, where the hell you been hiding at, Dill Pickle? Thank God you're gone. Is it time to do crimes? <laughs> yeah, man, we've been waiting on you. Cue ball. All right, enough dicking around. Are we doing this or not? Hell yes, let's do it. Let's do it. All right, here's the address. I need you to roll up there and check the place out. We go in Thursday night. Let's do it now. Let's do it now. I mean, what am I waiting for, right? This is what I do. I mean, I'm a criminal element man type, man. Just like you. Like, who am I kidding? Maybe you've got enough, Dill. Maybe you want to head home. Sleep it off. Oh, no. I want some action! I want some action, yes! Come on, let's get lost. Hey, you can be my mom. Yeah. I gotta have a mom. See, I got this problem, though. It's the Jiminy the Cricket is gonna get all upset with me, man, and I can't go messing with Jiminy the Cricket. She lives in my head with Mr. Cricket. Excuse me, Dr. Cricket. I mean, what am I gonna do when she finds out that I'm just like everybody said? What am I gonna do then, Bo? You got voices in your head? Is that what you're saying? You don't believe me, Donna? He does. Yeah, I have a world of craziness up here, man. So you might want to find somebody a little more stable to be your ride, man. Maybe I'm not your guy. I mean, burglary is a pretty tricky piece of business. I'm gonna shut your mouth now, You know what? Dude. I'm getting so sick of everybody telling me what to do. <laughs> All right, Wayne, put the gun down. Okay, Wayne. Man, I got a limp on my head. Okay, shut up, shut up, Lyle, shut up. That's okay, everything's fine. Am I bleeding there? Everything's fine. Shut up, Lyle. I don't care how long we've known each other. You screw this up. Bo, look at my hair, man. Am I bleeding? Bo, man, my head's gonna be all discolored. Diane, hi. I just got the call that you were here. To what do I owe this pleasant surprise? What? Do you recognize it? I don't even look any smaller. I never came here again. I was scared. I just felt like there was something here. Something too grown up, too real. Do you think this is the place I first went nuts or does it go further back? You're not crazy, Becky. I was once, right after college, before Philip and I were engaged. I kind of fell apart. Couldn't deal with being in the world, so spent some time in a hospital upstate, rehabilitating. I didn't know about that. Yeah, you missed that one. Probably because I missed most of it, too. I couldn't feel anything. I just lay in bed for three months, trying to work up enough energy to cry. Philip was with me through all of it. He read to me. He sat with me and tried to get me through it. He probably did. <sighs> sure wasn't me. So goddamn weak. Becky, how can you say that? I mean, what you did for me? Have I made your life any easier, honestly? Yes. You know, I can't read your mind, Dylan, but I know when you're lying. Becky, don't do this. I can't live like this. Dylan, Philip is my husband. I know you don't like him, but I need to be with him. I need to find him again. Yeah, you gotta do what you're told, right? That's not fair. Fair? I finally, for once in my life, I could see something 
something real, and then you tell me I gotta give, give it up. So how do you come at fair? I can't be with you, and I... I can't play this anymore. It's not a game. It's not something that you play. What am I supposed to do? You are going to be fine. God, Dylan. You have so much. You... You blew me away. You know that. You... I'm never gonna forget that. Couldn't we just... No. How do you expect me to just shut you off? Because you love me. Me a whiskey here, please. The thing is, you come in here and there's always some kind of trouble. Is that what you hear? Not two nights ago, you were in here doing your little MMA style tango with the song. They showed up, I left. We didn't associate. No, this ain't a goddamn drill, okay? You done got yourself fired. You're hanging out with known felons, and now Lyle is looking to bust your ass all across the desk. Well, can you? What's wrong with you? Dylan. Dylan. What the hell's wrong with you, oh, bastards? Oh, oh, boy, Lyle? You know what I'm looking at right now? My cell. But, hey, if you tell me what's going on with them brothers, you won't even have to think about it. No, I'll I mean, take it. I mean, I'm looking at it right now. I'm in it. What? This is where they put me, because this is where they see me. Wait, wait a minute. So this is when you start blaming the whole world for your crap. Is that right? No. No, this is where I stop. We ain't finished. I want you to get better. So stop worrying about everything. Everything's going to be fine. You just need to be alone for a while. No distractions. Till you feel yourself again. Rebecca, I love you. Now we both got lumps on our heads. Huh? It's Thursday. Time to go to work, Dill. I gotta be somewhere. Yeah. And we know where. You know, I told Bo that we should bust you up and leave you there and we're through, but he's got code. Two hours and comfortable living, Dill. Oh, I need to be somewhere. I'm asking. And I'm answering. <laughs> Later. None of your people will even know she was here. I'm betting she'll be back to normal in just a couple of months. Maybe.
Did you see who was driving that car? He told me to take them, so I took them. Do you know where you are? Yeah, I'm in the, um, I think it's the, um, Hot Power Clinic. It's a mental institution. Your husband ought to be a permanent resident, darling. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, we do request that you take your Are you on a plane? I'm, I'm headed your way. <sighs> Listen, I need to see the room. I want you to look around. I want to see everything. Is there anything you do? I understand, sir, but unfortunately, we cannot rent you a vehicle without a valid driver's license. I just, I just, I just don't have a with me right now, so I have a real important job in And I do hope you get that job. What I can do is arrange a cab for you. Perhaps a friend can overnight your license while I hold the rest. Sir. Thanks. Still at the airport. What are you doing, man? Ranting. Now twist to the left. <laughs> Slowly. Uh, okay, now see if you can find the empty space in there. I can't do this. I feel like a four year old. You can do it. Just relax. Same for an oxys or simple locks. Oh, I'm kind of here. You learned to do all this stuff anyway. Oh. School, mostly. I was wondering what you guys did in shop. Oh, I bet you took ballet, huh? Or tea, appreciation or something. Oh, <laughs> oh, Hot damn, that took me a week to learn that. You're a natural born criminal. I bet you say that to all the girls. Close? Yeah, I think so. Just keep going all the way through town. It's right by the train tracks. You can't miss it. Okay. I'll find it. Time to get a move on now. Uh, anybody in the hall? Um, wait a second. Wait till she leaves the hall. Check. Nervous? Check. Listen, hey, when you get out of there, um, you ever seen Canada? Why? What did you have in mind? I thought maybe you'd like to have a romance in an exotic setting. Go for it. Just walk like you know where you're going.
Becky, calm down. You can do this. so weird. 